I'm going to show you how to use dividers in the Notability app. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. I have Notability opened up here. And as you can see, I have some subjects that are currently not under a divider. And this can definitely get a little messy. So let's go ahead and create a divider for these subjects here. What we want to do is select the add icon in the upper left hand corner and it's going to give us two different options here. I can either create a subject or I can create a divider and keep in mind that what dividers do is they will organize certain subjects under a certain header. So for example, I have my summer 2021 courses right down here. If I tap on it, you can see that I have two subjects in there, my history 100 and my art 100. So dividers are really going to help you stay organized. So let's go ahead and create one. I'm going to make a divider here and I don't have an undergrad divider yet. So let me go ahead and create an undergrad divider and just naming this undergrad divider. And then what we wanna do is select done. Okay, now as you can see, I currently don't have any notes under here. So how do I get my notes and my, my subjects to be under this undergrad divider? Well, it's as simple as tapping, right? Tapping and doing a long hold and then dragging it to that divider, right under that divider. So once I have done that, well now you can see that I have one subject under my divider. The other thing that you can do is you can go ahead and tap on the divider, do a long hold and then drag it up. Okay. Now any of these subjects under wherever you place the divider will become part of the subjects in that divider. So for example, if I leave it right here, now notice that I have six notes in my undergrad divider. If I tap it, now I can see all of my six notes there. So hopefully this video helped you out. Using dividers is a great way to stay organized inside Notability. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments down below. And I'll see you next time.